used a little more cowbell. <laughs> What's going on, everybody? This is Al from PlaybookGamer.com. And a few items before we begin. First of all, now that I have over a thousand subscribers, I now have access to the community tab feature on YouTube. It's a nice way for me to send quick posts or images, videos only to my subscribers, which is really cool. So I'm going to take full advantage of it. I sent my first post out. Yesterday, anybody who is obviously subscribed and has the uh, notifications turned on, make sure you have those turned on. You will get uh, notifications from me. It could be on anything, something quick, but it's going to be a great way to reach out to my audience. A whole lot better than what I'm using on the website, which is the newsletter, which is fine, but it has its limitations compared to so many more uh, people who are viewing my content on the channel especially all the subscribers so be aware of that and again make sure you turn your notifications on for that on top of that i have added all of my youtube content over to the website instead of you going back and forth between the channel and the site you now have access to every single video on there it's just a nice quick way to you to look up any video you want while still staying on the site if you gotta look up something whatever that may be so make sure you check that out. It just says YouTube on the main menu at the very top. And what I may do is I may uh, create a quick video talking about all the new YouTube updates I just mentioned and throw it in the community tab. So be on the lookout for that. Okay, today we are taking on, I assume, USC in the National Championship game. In the last video, we took on Georgia in the SEC title game. One by a couple touchdowns. We're still number two in the country, but we're undefeated. So we know we are heading off to the Rose Bowl to more than likely take on USC. I haven't simulated the remaining of this week, so we can go ahead and do that. I didn't want you to miss out on the Heisman stuff, awards, you know, all the good stuff before we get into the game. Now, as I've mentioned the last several uh, videos for this particular dynasty, this will be the last game of this dynasty because I have a cool idea for a new dynasty that I think you'll all enjoy. I'm going to add some new wrinkles to it. It's going to be a much more long-term dynasty. I think you'll all be pleased with some of the new stuff. New offense, new defense, just kind of whatever I can uh, muster up. But it should be a whole lot of fun. But today, I want to take care of business and finish this dynasty strong with the national championship. So hopefully we could do that today. Okay, looks like I have one coach of the year. Let's see what else we won. Nicholas won the receiver of the year award. And there it is. Rose Bowl National Championship game against the Mighty Trojans of Southern California. And off to the Heisman Award. I don't know if Nicholas will win it. He was at the top of the list the last time we looked at it, but you just never know. He had a good game against Georgia. That should have helped. I'm Brad Nessler, and I want to thank all of you for joining us tonight in New York City for the presentation good of receiver. the Heisman Trophy. As you all know, this is a very special award. The man, the myth, the, the winner legend. will go down in history with all the other former greats that have won this award before. Brock Barkay, that's an awesome name. Ladies and gentlemen, your winner of this year's Heisman Trophy. Congratulations. Jovan Williams. Jovan Williams. Halfback, Miami. Hey, good for him. I had, kind of had a feeling that Nicholas wouldn't win it. He, I guess he didn't have enough touchdowns. Anyway, he's had an amazing year. Last two seasons have been great for him. All right, let's check out the rest of the stuff. So Nicholas finished second for the award. Uh, I do not want to save now. Let's go to, you know, in season recruiting is done. Of course, none of this matters since this is the last game of the dynasty. Uh, let's go to Sports Illustrated. Check out some other things. We've already went through the award winners. I wonder if we were close. Nicholas was third for the Maxwell. Burns finished second for the Big Narek. Oh, so close. And look who won it. Casey Ryan of 
USC. So we're going to have to face this guy today. And look here. We can go back to the very beginning. We can look up some USC guys. Let's see. On the Maxwell, nobody there. But here's the McNeric, the Ryan kid, and here's another linebacker, Luther Brown. They had two guys finish in the top six for the McNeric Award. That's insane. Let's see. Let's keep going. Uh, quarterback. We can go down to the bottom here. Let's see. The Walker Brown was a finalist. He finished third. Interesting, this Virginia Tech running back won the Walker, yet Jova Williams won the Heisman. That's just it's crazy. But here we go. USC has a halfback that's top in the league, Patrick Wood. We're going to have a hard time facing him today. We can keep going. Let's see. Wide receiver course. Nicholas won that. Tight end. I don't see a USC player there. Offensive lineman. Here we go. Starting right tackle for USC. Was the top five finalist for the O-line award. The Remington. Top center. Robinson finished ninth. Good for him. That's cool. Redshirt sophomore. Not bad. The Lombardi, of course, Burns finished second. Best linebacker here. Two of the top four played at USC. So, it's going to be interesting, to say the least. All right, let's keep going. The Thorpe. There it is. Another guy right here, Kevin Ellison. Finished ninth for the Thorpe Awards, having a good year. What is he? He's a strong safety. A big one at that. And the Groza Award. And the Punter Award. Their punter finished third. True freshman. I can check his stats real quick. I know we're going to look at that here in a minute. Or his ratings. He's just a 65 overall. I guess he's punted enough for it to matter. I guess you got to punt a lot. And I guess it's got to be your average yards per punt is probably how you could get on this list. I don't punt enough to know. So I guess that's a good problem to have. All right. Best returner. Nobody from USC there. USC coach finished third, which makes sense because they went undefeated. All right. Let's go to, and there's one of them. We can go back to this page here. The Ryan kid. Yeah, the linebacker. All right, all Americans. Let's see. Nicholas, we got first team all Americans. Both defensive ends made first team all American. I was surprised Sanders did. I guess he got a lot of tackles for a defensive end, six sacks, six forced fumbles probably helped. Get him on this list, but having two All American defensive ends, that's incredible. I don't know if I've ever done that before, to be honest. That's pretty cool to see. So, USC did not have any first team offensive or first teamers, but I'm sure they got some second teamers. Let's see. Wesley Brown made second team All American. Good for him. Let's see what else we have. So, none of those USC players. Made the first or second team unless I missed something. I don't think I did. I'm sure they got a ton in the Pac-10 or all-conference, but sure enough, I don't see them on any of the first or second team. Now we got the freshman All-Americans. Of course, we got Tom Thomas. Interesting that he made that. I mean, I guess because of his, he was on special teams, he may have returned a touchdown. I'm not, I'm not quite sure. That's probably why. But there's Wesley Brown. That's expected. Let's keep going here, and they're USC's punter. Then we could go to the SEC. SEC first team, Brown, Nicholas, both of our defensive ends. Look a look at the second team. Eric Bradley made second team all SEC. Good for him. Just looking at his stats right there, he almost had a little under 3,000 yards total offense and only 23 touchdowns, but he's been solid for us all season. I'm very pleased with what he's done for us. All right, we got a couple starting offensive linemen, second teamers, Kerry Bryant, Jason Jackson. True freshman Jason Jackson. Eight pancakes, I guess. That's what done him in, what helped. Five pancakes only for Kenny Williams. So we got a guard, outside linebacker, Derek Moore. Good for him. Keith Fitzhugh, couple interceptions. Cool deal. All right. Bowl games, uh, none of that matter. We know where we're going. So I think we're ready to go to the play week. And let's look at USC stuff here. 
They're B plus overall. Their defense is looking really strong. And you look at their stats, their worst stat is their turnover differential at 50. But you look at the rest of them, 43rd in rush offense. So this will be their defense is going to be nasty. We'll see if we can do any damage to them. And we're about to find out. Hopefully we don't have anybody getting in trouble. Of course, this is the last game of the Dynasty, so it's not going to matter. Plus, my discipline bars all the way down to nothing. So somebody could practically do something really heinous, and I could I would still play him because we're going to need him to play to try to win today. This takes a little bit to simulate because we're in the last week. I'm really excited, but I'm working on some new projects for the website, for the channel. Uh, I'm going to keep those under wraps for now, but I'm really excited by, by the direction where everything is going. I hope you are as well. One thing I want to bring back is I'm going to do more tutorial stuff. I've been doing some stuff on the website, writing some posts, but I'm going to go back and I need, I'm going to add some video tutorials, put that in the rotation of these Dynasty video, Dynasty and franchise videos. Which means I may have to boost up the three to four videos a week instead of like just two to three. Okay, nobody got in trouble. Good deal. Now USC, they run a West Coast offense. It's all under center. They run a 4-3 defense. That's good. Neither team has anybody out. Keep it fair. Their quarterback has a put up a ton of yards, but they got a three-headed monster at quarterback, halfback, and wide receiver. I'm curious to see who their impact players are on offense. I don't think the running back is. The quarterback might be. We got perfect weather. Good deal. Hi, everybody. This is Brad Nestler. With me, as always, Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreit. Pasadena. Perfect, day as we get set for perfect weather. Good deal. Wind is not going to affect anybody. season is over. We're going bowling. And here come the Trojans. I'm not a big fan of USC, but I do like their uniforms. It's a good color combo. Eric Bradley. Hopefully he has a good day. Of course, they got the, that's a glitch. They got Fitzhugh's name on the back of her center, Robinson. Oh, they're picking us. All righty. Hopefully we can live up to that. All right, we want the ball to start the second half. Let's check out their roster. Okay, starting quarterback, 90 overall. He can't run, so we're going to blitz him hard today. Just looking at his throw power and accuracy, really good, both in the 90s. But his backup can run... For days, and so the third stringer. So if Harper goes down, we'll have to be aware of not blitzing so hard on this guy. Halfback, 90 overall. This is Patrick Wood. Was up, was a finalist for the uh, Walker, I'm pretty sure, award. And his backup is just as good. Caleb Brown, 93 speed. They're in good shape at halfback. They got one good fullback. Really big one to add at that too. All right. Wide receiver, look at this, 91, 91, 90. One of them is an impact guy, 80, 80. Just really good town of wide receiver across the board. Tight end, 89 and 82. Neither one's very fast. That should help us a, a little bit. Their tight end's a first team, all pack 10. All right, Offensive line, you got 87, 89, 91, 82, and 89. We've went up against tougher offensive lines. If I'm not mistaken, the Georgia offensive line was more talented. But this is a solid offensive line, don't get me wrong. I mean, that's, some, that's a good group right there. So Y'all look pretty young. That's why there's not as many in the 90s. You got a sophomore, a sophomore, junior, junior, sophomore. So that entire line will be coming back next season. All right, like I said, they run a 4-3. They got a true freshman, defensive end, 6'8", 265, 74 speed. That's one of those rare 
true defensive ends that are worth going after. Otherwise, you know me, I like to go after linebackers and bringing them down to defensive end. This guy's the real deal, Lucille. That's a humongous defensive end. Good for him. Okay, right in, 91 overall. 6'6", 242. So they got some size on the edge. Defensive tackle, 90, 84, 80. Not bad. Okay, here's where their bread is butters, their linebackers. They got a true freshman at left line, outside linebacker, Thomas Edwards, 80 overall, 84 speed. Love the speed there at, on outside linebacker. All right, Luther Brown, the middle linebacker, is an impact guy. He's got backups behind him that are pretty good as well. Then you got this guy. He's not even an impact player, thank the Lord. He'd be even tougher. Casey Ryan, 91 overall. Arguably the best linebacker in the country. Corners, 92 and 91. They got their tall. One is 91 speed. And their third stringer, a true freshman, John Smith, 6'4", 176, 96 speed. That's my ideal corner. I would love to have him on my team. And he's playing nickel today. All right, 92 overall, a free safety. Then you got 98 overall. That's, wow. You don't see too many that safeties that high. So their secondary is as good as it gets. 92, 91, 92, 98. So that is their strength. I thought their linebackers would be their strength, but it looks like their secondary is even better. So, yes, their defense is solid. All right, kicker, 80 overall. Punter, terrible, but he's actually one of the better punters in the nation. I don't know. Either way, hopefully we'll get to see him on the field a lot today by he punting quite a bit. And, of course, their kick return looks really nasty. Okay, I think that is it. So, play our game offensively, defensively, and I think we'll be okay. Start off right with a good kick. Now, I'm sure they got their impact. They got one impact guy on return. It's a good stop there. Now, they're a balanced offense. I'm sure they'll keep me on my toes going back and forth. But since they got a wide receiver that's an impact guy, I'm going to take the chance and think they're going to throw a little bit more than usual. And they're going with a toss play out of the gate. And, ooh, he stepped out. Otherwise, that was going to be six points. <laughs> uh, let's do a one high out of nickel since they're going four wide. I didn't need the shift. Uh, let's do that. Oh, crap. I took a bad angle, and he's gone. Ooh. I took a terrible angle. That's all on me. That's a little angle right. It's a great little man beater. And I, well, yeah, that was just all bad right there. Okay, not off to a good start. Let's go zone cover two blitz. I'm going to take a chance and say they're going to throw. There we go. You just guess at it, and hopefully you pick the right one. Going four wide here. Let's go quarters at a nickel. We're going back to ace bunch. Wide open. Wow. It's touchdown. Wow. What do you do? You know? All right. So that was a pretty easy touchdown for them. <clears throat> He had great protection. And he was just wide open. Mm. That's one of the downsides of running quarters. In the middle of the field tends to get open a little bit more than usual. All right. Let's get on offense and try to tie this thing up. So that's the positive or the biggest advantage with a balanced offense. You just don't know which way they're going to go. But it's obvious. They're very talented. I guess they're probably the most talented team we've faced this season. Georgia's just as talented, I think. <clears throat> Florida's really talented. Just don't fumble it. Okay. Let's get these out of the way. Let's do a speed option out of the gate. We're going zone 4-3. 
they're doing that. Uh, let's just run to our left. I couldn't pitch it in time. So he decides to hold on to it, and it goes nowhere. Let's do a direct for Tereshinsky. Going man nickel. Ball on their own 14. Doing that. Uh, good blocking there. Get the first down. Okay, next up, let's go. Let's do QB choice at a bunch. We're going zone 4-3. I like the shift. Just not the blocking. <laughs> Man, that was terrible. Okay, we're in the middle of the field, so we got to try to do deep cross up. We're going man. So what I may do is... We'll do that, get him out of the way. And we get the first down. Whew! Okay. We got that one going. Uh, let's go back. Um, I want to do a PE read. We're going man 4 3. I'll probably throw it. I'm definitely going to throw it. Going one high here. And give it to Nicholas. I don't know if we got the first. <clears throat> Second in inches. Let's go back to the speed option. We'll do it at a spread this time. We'll see if we can just pick up the first. Ooh, I wonder what happens if I break him. That's good defense, you know. So, uh, it is third and two. We can do direct and just try it this way. They're going nickel, so I don't know. Oh, get a block on that linebacker right there. There we go. Just enough. Get the first down there. Uh, let's try. Let's go back here. No, let's let's get Jenkins going a little bit. Let's do QB choice from Ace. We're going man nickel. I will be running to the left. Get a block there. Get the first down. And from here, I want to do option give. We're going zone. I'm still going to hand this off. And it's just... Jenkins didn't block anybody there. So where am I? Let's, uh, I'm on the, on the 17. Oh, well, um, I had something on my mind what to do. Let's, uh... Let's go back and run the sweep option again. They're going zone, though. This may not work. Uh, we can go ahead and try it anyways. And a fumble. And that's terrible. Okay, we're very fortunate to get that ball back. So it is third and 16. We can try tight end cross. We're going zone. This will probably go to somebody on the left. Try to I, distract that safety if we can. Didn't get the touchdown, but we got the first down. Okay. We'll go back to option give. We're going zone. We'll just hand this off and hopefully we get good blocking. And we got in first to six. Okay, that was a fun adventure. Somehow, someway, we finally got into the end zone. It wasn't the easiest of drives, nor the prettiest, but a touchdown is a touchdown. That was a great throw by Bradley to pick up the first. Right where it needed to be. Thankfully, they went cover two. If they went three or four, we'd probably be hurting a little bit. Uh, 
All right, we got to figure out what to do on defense. Just got to make a stop here and there. I'd love to get a turnover or two. That'd be nice. Let's do a one high for now. Like, I really want a zone blitz and go after that guy, but. Good stop there. Thankfully, they ran the ball. I'm going to take a chance to go zone blitz. I'm just assuming they're going to throw. And they're doing that. Ugh, not expecting that. They make a good blocking here. Let's go here instead. Let's go right here. Oh. Oh, he dropped it. Jeez, we'll take it. Okay, third and 11. We'll go cloud. Got to get a stop here. Oh, he had all day. Thankfully, that was good. We'll take it. I think he had all day to throw. Okay, we got to take advantage of this. Let's get the ball back. Get back on offense. Try to score and get our first lead of the day. Somebody get a block on the right. Okay, now I want to start off. It's on my mind, so I'm going to roll with it. Let's go gun trips. And we're going to go with an RPR. We'll go slot cross, or we're going man. So what we're going to do is we're going to hang back and just throw it to Nicholas, or if that other safety comes down, we'll go to guard high. We're going one high. And he's gone. Big play. Big play. Now, we'll break this play down. This is very important. I've talked about this in the past. We can watch this replay here. Now, let's talk about something. Okay. I, I'm i holding the button down as hard as I can. It's a hold button. As soon as he catches it, I'm still holding down the button. I'm still holding down the button. I'm not touching anything else. The CPU is controlling Nicholas at this point. That's something to think about when you are throwing the ball. Sometimes the computer does a better job of rat running post-catch than you ever could. So, food for thought. All right, let's do QB choice out of spread. They're going nickel, man. Let's see who's on that nick slot. Uh, can we get a block? We're going to try it. Get around him at least. Ah, that kid's fast. Got about eight yards there. He finally got over a thousand. Good for him. Let's just do QB choice and pick up the first if we can. We're going four three zone. I'm still going to hand it off to him, but we'll bring. Good block there by Nicholas, and I didn't get in. So, I don't trust my kicker, and it's third and two. We'll go back to direct. I'm pretty sure that right nickel's blitzing. High snap does not help things, but we get the first. Just enough. All right, that should be the last play of the drive. Yeah, I'm going to let that one go. All right, end of the course, 7-7, seven to seven, but we are on the verge of scoring, so we got to finish this drive out. Fun game so far. Both teams are pretty are playing pretty clean. So what haven't I called? What haven't I done lately? Uh, let's go here. Let's do a triple from the slot. Now I'm afraid they go four three, and they're going to, but they're going man. They're shifting that way. Yeah, I didn't think I had a chance on the outside, so I just went up the a gap. Only got a yard out of it. Nothing great. Let's go here and do power option from split. We're going man. It doesn't matter what I call formation-wise. It seems like they're de determined to stay in their 4-3 package, which I don't blame them. That's their best unit or their best package. Get a block right there. They're fast, and they're fast. So it's what, third and three? We can try another speed option. They're going man-nickel. 
who's on who. Ooh, that left guard could get that block on that linebacker. We'll be okay. Good deal. Good deal. Go, Bradley. Go. All right, good drive. It's a good answer off that stop we had on defense. And we have our first lead of the day. All right, let's get back on defense. Try to get another stop. As long as they don't run a ton, I think we'll be okay defensively. I think I can throw enough zone at him to where that quarterback can make a mistake or two. He's going to put some yards on us, but not without making a mistake down the road. Oh, wow, what a juke that was. Jeez. Somehow, some way, they didn't get a touchdown. That was a crazy juke. Watch this. We'll go back here. Just a crazy juke. I'm like, oh, my gosh. Look at this. <laughs> Somehow, some way, he didn't get it in the end zone. Okay, uh, let's try a zone blitz. They're on the right side of the 50. They start this drive. Uh, I'll leave it as is. All day, jump up for that. Good deal. That's why you get tall corners. I'm going to do, hmm, let's do a one high. I can see him try to make up for that with a run play. Hopefully. Nope, they're going to pass. Oh, good throw. Just to, threw it right on the cut. I think he got hit as soon as he threw it. We'll run some quarters. Ah, dang it, that's why I get for diving. You can't dive unless you feel like you absolutely have to. Let's go with a hmm, one high. I don't know. I can see him just running in here. Oh, what in the world was that? What a goofy play this was. Look at this. It's a screen. It's a screen to either side, but he shovel past it. And they still got in. <laughs> what do you do? <sighs> well... They're about to tie it back up. So that was a terrible defensive drive for us. Just couldn't get a stop. Can't get any pressure on the quarterback either. When he's got time to throw, he can hurt us. So I'm thinking we may do a lot of quarters. I want him to keep throwing a ton, and eventually he'll throw an interception. All right, we are on the left hash. Just trying to think what my options are here. Let's go here to speed option from Ace. We're going zone dime, okay? I want to get away from that safety. So let's just go this way. Mm, I probably shouldn't have juked. Not a whole lot there. Let's go. We can do another speed option. We're going man 4 3. Shifting that way. So who's on? There we go. We'll just go left. Ah, just great defense. So here's what I'm thinking it's third and 12. I honestly want to do wide receiver under. Right, they're going man. I don't know if Nicholas can get the first down. He's coming down. Please let that other safety come down. High snap. Make a play. Oh, almost intercepted. Ah, oh, jeez. All right, we'll punt it. That was good defense. 
That was a good hit, too. They brought both safety, so I had no choice but to go over the top. All right, we're going to do a sky punt. I don't want him to have an easy return. They're going to have great field position. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Shoot. Flag down, please. Let it come back. Block in the back, probably. Clipping. We'll definitely accept that. I'm going to do quarters. They're loving their pro-normal formation. Hey, somebody get him. All right, got about five yards there. Four. Oh, just three. We'll do quarters from nickel this time since they're going four wide. Ball on their own 39. The Trojan come out in a bunch formation. Back to pass. Steps up in the pocket. Ooh, he caught that. Did he get the first? He got the first down. I'm going to stay in quarters. Ace empty. Uh-oh. Wow, they're a little shallow route. Okay, I want to go zone blitz, but I can see him running it here as well. So, but I'm going to take a chance on the blitz. Don't run to the right. Let me go on with that. Uh-oh. Ooh, thank the Lord he overthrew it. All right, second and ten. We'll go back to quarters. I got a lot of field to cover on the left. Ah, another first down. Well, oh my gosh, look at that. So they're killing me over the middle, and that's what happens with you got quarters. Just nobody's getting to them. That's what worries me a little bit. None, my, neither one of my defensive ends are getting much pressure by themselves. Ah! Come on! You got to catch that! Oh, that was pick six! Oh, ah, ah. Let's get back at it. We'll just run quarters again. They are loving them some ace empty. Ooh, overthrew it. Just high. Okay, third and ten. We're going to go cloud. If we could just somehow hold them to a field goal, that'd be great. He's got all day to throw. Oh, he overthrew it. All right, good deal. We'll hold him to a field goal. That gives us a minute and a half to try to do something on offense before the end of the half. I'd love to somehow get some points before we head to the locker room. They're a really good ball team. They're very talented. they got a really good quarterback. He missed a couple throws on that drive, but... Of course, we should have had one picked, but that's neither here nor there. All right, let's see if number 80 can make some magic happen. Nope. Okay. On the 14, this may be kind of tough. Let's go. We could try slot cross. We're going zone this time, so we're going to do our rollout. Bring him over. Doing okay there. Cover two. Ah. Ah. Bounced off his helmet. It's not the best throw in the world. So I'm going to run it here just in case something happens. They'll probably call a timeout. They're going man. And I think let's do this. Let's do that. They're going zone. He passes it complete. And he it's not a whole lot there. Third and eight. So 
I'll probably go back to this play again. Slot cross. Let's try it again. Hopefully we'll make a catch here. If not, they're going to have a whole minute to do something. But... Let's go. Big play. Let's call a timeout. They went cover two again. Just enough. Whew. The timing has to be spot on there for that to work. Okay, we got to keep going down the field. Let's go back the wide receiver under. We're going zone this time. So we're going to look for the shallow first. If that's not open, we'll just roll out with the angle on the right. Not really seen it on the middle. Ooh, terrible throw. Oh, gosh. Just a bad throw. All kinds of nastiness right there. Uh, let's go. Let's do speed option. I still got two timeouts in under a minute, which is a lifetime. Everybody and their brother's coming. Oh, please bring everybody up. Let's do this instead. Are they double teaming him? No, they're doing it. Give it to number 80. Let's go, Nicholas. Ah! Big play. I wanted to go to the matchup that we had an advantage on. So I done a hot route with him. A slot fade. That's pretty much what that was. Okay. Let's do option give and let's run some clock. We're going zone. If this doesn't work, then we may go to like power option or speed option or out of this same set. Get it down to a couple seconds. Nothing there, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to go here. And I called the wrong play. Dang it, I swear. i got to call a timeout. Dang it! <laughs> well, there goes a timeout I could have used. I hit the wrong button. Oh, gosh. All right, let's do power option. We're going zone. I didn't have an audible set up for it either. That didn't help. Now, that is, let's do that. No, I want him over there. He's our best blocker at wide out. Wow, he came from nowhere. Let's call another timeout. Dang it, dang it, dang it. Uh, third and goal. Let's... Uh, let's just go for a field goal. Yeah, I'm afraid if we don't get in, we won't get anything. And I wasted that other timeout, so that was my fault. We're not going to get six points here. It's better than nothing, so at least we tied it. So just try to survive these next seven seconds, and we'll get the ball started in the second half. Good stop there. Four seconds. I don't expect them to do anything crazy here. We're just do quarters. Keep everything in front of us. I expect them to run it. And they went with a halfback double option. Okay. End of the half. 17 all. Pretty entertaining so far. We can check some stats. We're moving the ball well, but they're keeping us out of the end zone just enough. Neither team has committed a turnover. So a pretty clean game all around. Look at the individual stats. I feel like I'm throwing a little bit more than I need to. Of course, that last drive, we had to throw quite a bit just to get down the field. Uh, but otherwise, he's throwing pretty well. Running the ball. Let's go back here. Brown is touching the ball quite a bit. His average isn't all that great. But everybody's getting their touches at one point or another on the ground. Okay. Second half. He's got to get it done. I want to finish this dynasty strong. I'm going to keep it in the end zone. We don't get a whole lot of chances to stay up the middle. So I'm going to try a deep cross up. 
Now we're going up against arguably the best safety in the country by rolling out to his side. Good throw. Eh, let's just get out of bounds. I was going to juke, but it didn't seem worth it. Okay, that's a good play there. Let's do triple from split. We haven't got to do that yet. We're going zone. 4-3. And I, just, I didn't see who was coming. I had to keep it. I didn't want to take the chance. Second and 11. Let's go. Let's do direct from nickel or from wide trips. That guy's blitzing. Oh, can we get a block on that guy? Oh, we looked out. Now he's going to chase me. But we almost got the first. Let's do speed to try to pick up the first. Don't need to get cute here. We're going zone. Great. Did you see the block? We got to go back and look at this. Look at this blocking by the All-American here. Oh, that's a good block by the tight end. And then he knocks this dude out. I thought he got both blocks. But either way, good blocking there. Enough to get the first. Okay. Now, I want to go here. And we're going to do QB choice from Bunch. We're going zone. If they was going man, I was probably going to hot rat to our wide receiver option. But we're going to just hand this off. Good block there. Good block there. Let's just get out of bounds. I don't trust that safety. All looks good there. Let's do QB choice. I'm going to flip it this time. We're going zone 4-3. I don't blame them. I like the shift. Mississippi State lines up in a shotgun set. Adds great defense by that corner. Stood his ground for sure. Didn't get a thing out of that either. Let's do speed option. They're blitzing the nickel. Now what are they going to do about the other slot? They're doing that. Good. We're going to run to our left. Just enough to get the first. Or you take it to the house for six points. Ah! The juke sealed the deal there. Just enough to get the pitch off. One juke. And he was gone. Big play. All right. All right, good deal. That's a good start to the half. That's how you want to come out of the locker room. Go right down the field and get six points. Hopefully we'll get seven. And it's back to defense we go. Crazy game. A lot of fun. USC is holding up their end of the bargain for sure. Right down the middle. Good shoestring tackle there. Okay. They're going too tight end too wide. Let's just do quarters. They may go ace normal here, and they do have ace normal in their playbook. I've played them enough over the years to kind of remember what they have. Get a stop, and I'm stuck. I can't do anything. Thankfully, somebody got a stop there, but he got five out of it. Uh, I'm going to take a chance. We're going to do zone blitz. Second and five coming up here. Ball on the 32-yard line. USC goes with the ace set here. Get him. Oh. Wow. Oh, he drops it. Just thank the Lord. That was a perfect throw. Okay. Third and five. We're going to go cloud. We got to get to this can if we can. Almost stick with Burns, though. Oh, my gosh. Just enough. I thought we was going to get a big play right there. Oh, first down. What do you do? All right, let's do another zone blitz. They're determined to throw the ball more than run it, which I expected. But they go back to this. I'm going to stay right here. I'm going to occupy this guard if I can. Oh, my gosh. I cut over too much. Then we'll have that halfback read play. 
That gets everybody open on the defensive line. Back to quarters we go. I bet they're doing ace bunch. No, they're going back to ace empty. Let's do a tie and see what happens. Ooh, that was risky throw right there. He is asking to get picked off. Okay, back to cloud. At least it's third and nine. Somebody make a play here. Oh, good. Oh, my gosh. First down. What a throw. Thread the needle. Oh, gosh. Okay. And why am I going 4 3 gets a. Oh, okay. Good. They're going. I thought they was going 4 wide for whatever reason. This is the halfback pass. Oh, I couldn't get over there in time. I figured I'd get blocked by that lineman. Uh, going to, hmm, let's do a one high. We're just slowly moving down the field. Good stop. Under front. That's why I call it. Okay, instead of, I'm going to go... I'm going to change it up a little bit. We're going to go Monster 2. This is like the Thunder 2 from the 4-3. I'm sending six guys. I want him to throw quick. I'm going to troll the middle linebacker. Uh, that's that's the chance you take, you know. You got it off in time. They're chewing up a lot of clock on this drive. I'm going to go back to zone blitz. Go play action. Go play action. Don't run to the right. All day to throw. Oh, my gosh. Nothing you can do about that. I could have took one of those guys over, but look at that. Cross field throw. I mean, that's just like a Hail Mary play. It just... Oh, okay, let's get back on offense and try to get our lead back. That's when you want really good secondary players. <laughs> An impact guy back there who can maybe have the wherewithal to put his hand up or intercept it. I didn't feel comfortable taking one of those guys over. I probably would have made it worse. Another kick and a half, but I'm going to take a chance. Great run by Thomas. We'll take it. Okay, let's go. We have a guy to give the Tereshinsky a lot today. We're going zone dime. I don't mind that. And it's just, just good defense. He couldn't hold his block. We'll go speed option, zone nickel. Uh, I kind of want to keep it as is. Let's just go ahead and try it. Somehow, someway, we got a few extra yards out of that. So it is 33. Uh, I want to, we're going to try direct. We're going man nickel. I'll, let's see who's on. Okay, we're going to go over toward the left. Just enough to get the first. Let's just get out of bounds. No point in trying to make something bad happen. Okay, let's go. Let's do QB choice from Ace. We're going zone nickel. Let's just go ahead and get an extra blocker while we're at it. Great blocking everywhere. Oh, awesome blocking. We'll go back and look at this. Guard high. The pulling receiver gets a good blocker. Tight end gets a good little block. But look at that block right there. Just enough. Now, that safety still made the tackle. Either way. Big play. Okay. Right hash. Let's go. 
I'm gonna go back. QB choice from Bunch. And they're going man. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm going to audible to our wide receiver play. Ooh, I probably could have. Mm. That's okay. We can make something work from this, I think. They're not gonna catch him. Six points! Ah! Feed the studs! Feed the studs! Just a great block right there. Just enough to get a nudge on that defender. And that's a great way to end the quarter. We now have the lead back. Headed to the fourth quarter. Get your hands up. Fourth quarter. Let's finish this thing. We got to get a stop on defense in order to win this thing, though. Otherwise, they're going to just keep scoring right with us. Okay. Everybody make good decisions. Not the best kick in the world. And their impact guys got it. And my kicker just got destroyed. Good stop, though. Okay. Uh, let's just go. It seems like they're going through their bigger set, so let's go with a 4 4. And I'm clicked. Do that. I don't like the look of that. Let's do that instead. Get him! Oh, man, he had a chance to get him. We'll take that, though. I'm okay with that play. He lost a yard or two, didn't he? Lost two. Let's do quarters. It's second down and 12 to go. Somehow we got to survive this down just to get the third. I have a lot of field to cover. Good stop there. So now it's third and what, six, third and five? I'm going to go back to Cloud. They've been able to attack it pretty well lately. But I need those extra guys back there. Otherwise, he's just going to pick us apart. If I could just somehow get to him. Oh, he overthrew it. Yes. Punt the ball. All right, we got to get a, another touchdown here. Go up two scores, and that'll really hurt him. So now we're in the fourth quarter. There's nothing stopping me from running clock. So that's probably what I'll do. Treat everything as normal except run clock. Okay, let's try. Let's do speed option from wide trips. Let's let Brown touch the ball some more. They're going man, 4-3. Now, who's on who? This is what worries me. Let's just... That's what I was afraid of right there. They had everybody and their brother on that side. It's okay, though. Let's go. Uh, let's do QB choice from trips. I'm trying to force him into a nickel or dime look, but it's not working. The clock is running, so we're going to let it run. No reason not to. We're going to bring Nichols over. Hopefully he can get a block on that linebacker. That'd be great. Man, I've done that way too late. Get a block right there, though. We got out of bounds, but that's okay. Good play there. I'm going to go back here. We'll do QB choice from trips over. We may have a chance here. They're going man nickel. If we could just get good blocking off the edge, we could get a decent game here. The clock has stopped, so we can go ahead. Good block there. I'm just going to... Just don't fumble it. Don't fumble it. Oh. Impact, guys. I'm here to tell you. They can do damage. Okay. Let's do speed option from split. We're going man 4-3. Or no. Are they going man or zone? I think they may be going zone. Yeah, they're going zone. We're going to run to our right. Good block there. We'll cut up field. Big play by you-know-who. Number 15. They went in zone. I'm looking at the safeties up top. They're going cover two, which means I need to cut up field as soon as possible because of that guy right there. If I would have went straight out, He'd have been sitting there waiting on us. So just cut up field. Good block by the tight end. Get the first down. Okay. Next up.
We'll go to QB choice from here. We're going man. We'll try to run some more clock. And they're going dime. And I got to pee really badly. But I got to hold it in. I got I got more important things to do than pee right now. <laughs> oh, jeez. All right. Get it down to a couple seconds. Six punts! Ah! All right. We still got a lot of time left. They can easily go right down the field and score. We didn't run a whole lot of clock there, unfortunately. But that's okay. We scored. That's what matters. Say we only took a minute 19 off, but... All right. Let's get another stop on defense and end this thing. What a hit. That's a good receiver right there. Okay, let's go, I'm going to go zone blitz. It's not really working. I don't know why I need to keep doing it because we're not getting to them. Unless they go like play action. But their offensive line is protecting the ball really well. They're protecting him. But there you go. Play action. I'm able to get to him. All right, quarters at a nickel. We're going back to ace empty. Uh, another shallow route. They killed us with that play or that route today. Third and eight. I'm gonna go ahead and just do cloud. Let's see if we can make a big play here. Oh, get him! Get him! Fumble! Somebody get him! Oh, huge play! Go! Oh wow! That's game over right there. As long as we don't do anything stupid right here. What a play. Oh, my gosh. We'll do QB choice from spread. And they're going nickel. And they took all their linebackers out. Oh, well, that's right. They don't have any impact middle linebackers out. Get to the outside. Six points. Game over! In this thing. Make a comeback now, USC. Give it a try. That's what you get for fumbling. Okay. Now we can breathe. First time I've been able to breathe the entire hour. Huh. All right. Let's kick an extra point. And I may have missed that. Nope. Right down the middle. We'll get the ball back eventually. And then we're going to run the rest of the clock out. And declare ourselves national champions. Thankfully, we got a stop there. He had some decent blocking after that. I'm going to go back to a zone blitz. Good protection. I think he got tipped. Or maybe he dropped it. Uh, yeah, I think the corner got a tip on it. Second and ten. Oh, you! Oh, you got to be. That should have been intercepted. He had, he was just sitting there. Yeah, let me tell you something. These passes are exactly what they need. We'll do quarters. I know it was third down, but we'll just do quarters. Keep everything in front of us. I prefer to stick with quarters up throughout. Yeah, right over the middle. And again, they're going to do a hurry up, which is why I wanted to stay in quarters. They'll call something goofy here. They're going to go halfback draw. Again, they'll probably run the same play. Yeah, that's what I figured. That's a good cut. Get the first down. And this is the glitchy part. I wish they would have fixed that, but they just 
CPU doesn't know how to handle this part. Sometimes they'll switch. Sometimes they'll go to a different play. But they're going to sit here and run halfback draw all the way through. And they'll still get yards out of it, but still. There we go. Finally call a timeout. I'm still sticking with the quarters. I just need a base offense to stick with. I fully expect them to get a first down here. Yeah. Ran hitches. Call another timeout. They've been run, running a lot of air raid type routes. Hitches and shallows and such. Touchdown. Wow, good throw. All right, I told you they'd go right down the field and do something. So they're going to onside kick it. As long as we return it or get it, we'll be okay because they've already used up two timeouts. And I'm about to pee in my pants. <laughs> ah, the rush. Okay. There we go. Just get down. And that should be it. Like I said, they only got one timeout. Do QB Neal. They'll call a timeout, and it'll be all over. National champions. That's the perfect way to end the dynasty. And get ready for the next one. And we shouldn't have no issues here in terms of do anything goofy. We got enough time to in the fourth down. It should just take one more snap. Let's go ahead and do it now. Doesn't matter. All right, national champions, baby. I hope you enjoy this dynasty. I gave you two seasons worth of gun run heavy option type stuff. Hopefully you got something from it. What I got from it was all the QB choice. I'm enjoying that play more now than ever. I can use that in future offenses if needed. But there you go. Mississippi State, their first national championship. You're welcome. Awesome. The mullet's going to get drenched. And Gatorade, maybe? No, it's not in this animation. That's awesome to see. There we go. Never gets old, fellas. Never gets old. All right. Hope you enjoyed all that. The next video, we'll do our Man No 07 final preseason game. And then after that, we'll start our new dynasty here in 06 with a new team that I will name later. And I think you'll enjoy it. All right, guys. I'll talk to you later.